We're gonna start with our stock 250 and I'm gonna show you guys how to get the stock body work off. First, we're gonna start by removing the seat. Passenger seat's just a quick turn to the key. On the rider seat, there's two fasteners in behind the seat. We'll remove those. When working on your motorcycle, it's always a good idea to unhook the battery. We'll do that with the negative cable. So next, we'll do the passenger grab handles. Two bolts on each side. Next, we'll work on removing the tail section. There's two bolts on each side the wiring for the lights and signal lights, and four plastic clips underneath. Move the plastic under the tail section to uh, unplug the wiring. Before removing the plastic on the left side, you have to uh, unhook the cable for the seat lock. There's a, uh, a barbed clip on each side, just pull and, uh, and it'll, it'll pop off. The whole thing should slide back, just have to re... Unwind the uh, lock cable from the seat lock and the whole tail section just slides off. One, uh, one more bolt for the license plate bracket. The entire stock tail section has been removed. Next we remove the side fairing. There's three fasteners and three clips. The first, second fastener is in behind. The third is behind the signal light facing down. And there's three clips which you can't see. Just behind the handlebar. The first, second, and the third is behind the signal light. All right, so you're gonna have to get behind the fairing and pull a little bit, because these clips hold pretty hard, but unclip it from the fairing bracket at the bottom and continue pulling for the third clip. Pull the signal light wiring from the, behind the clamp and unhook the signal light wire. The three clips that I talked about are barbed and you just have to get your fingers in behind the fairing and pull them. They clip into the three places on the bodywork. Both side fairings have been removed. The steps on the left are the same as the right. We'll move on to the front fairing now. There's four fasteners in the dash, have to be removed, two on each mirror, and four clips, two on each side. Unhook your front fairing from the mirror mounts. And pull it straight forward, but you've got some wiring for the headlight to unhook. So here's the wiring for the headlight. And also the tip over switch.
The front fairing has been removed. Now we'll move on to the lower. Four fasteners are holding that on, two on each side. We'll move to the sides and the fuel tank. The sides have three fasteners. We'll remove those. You have to put these fasteners in a safe spot because we're going to need these for sure putting the race bike together. There's another clip in behind the uh, panel and a second one up top here and the side panel comes off. 